Imagine a small town nestled in the Rockies, frozen in time. Imagine a quiet place surrounded by massive peaks, crystal waters, lakes and streams. This place is Redstone. Redstone has changed little in the last hundred years, nor will it in the next hundred, because the entire town is listed in the National Register of Historic Places. Redstone Inn, a unique historic hotel, has been restored and maintained in its turn-of-the-century splendor. Redstone was founded by John Cleveland Osgood, who developed large-scale coal mining in Redstone and throughout Colorado. Legend has it that he bought uh, the Coal Basin Coal Claim, which is about eight miles west of here, for $500 from a couple of uh, gold and silver prospectors who didn't care anything about coal. The beehive coking ovens in Redstone spurred the construction of the Crystal River Railroad. This rail line connected the coal mines up valley to the main lines in Carbondale, where the coke was then transported to the steel mills in Pueblo. The inn was built in 1902. The entire community was finished, including all the um, 92 cottages, the castle, uh, by 1902. Osgood built Redstone as a social industrial experiment to improve working conditions for miners and to stave off the march of the unions. Redstone is unique, uh, not only in Colorado, but uh, unique uh, nationally. Uh, Osgood was trying to uh, keep the union out, trying to uh, uh, keep his workers uh, contented, uh, very much in a paternalistic way. He um, developed Redstone as a uh, model village that would be uh, based upon the philosophy of industrial betterment. And uh, of course he built his uh, mansion, his summer mansion, uh, nearby and so you wanted this a uh, redstone village as a, as a model village, a showcase for his philosophy of industrial betterment. The Redstone Inn was for the bachelor miners that actually worked the coke ovens across the street here and the cottages down the boulevard were for the married families. All of which featured indoor plumbing and electricity, a luxury for the times. Well, after um, 1903, then Osgood continued to struggle against the United Mine Workers. He wanted to keep them out of Colorado entirely. He was the leading coal industrialist uh, in, in Colorado, and he uh, joined forces with the other operators, and uh, they, they fought the Union. It, uh, it was a, uh, a nasty, a brutal fight. The coking here was not very uh, economically advantageous. Redstone just closed down after about nine years, so it was developed between 1901 and closed down in 1909, so it had a very short history. In 1925, John Osgood returned with his third wife, and they had plans to reopen the Redstone Inn as a resort hotel. Uh, he died shortly before it opened, and his Lucille, his bride um, opened it, but of course then came the stock market crash, World War II, Redstone became pretty much a ghost town with a population of 12. This unique history and the quiet isolation of Redstone have preserved and protected the inn and the town from sprawling development found elsewhere in the West. This charm is evident to all who visit, dine and stay in the town and inn. This charm also makes Redstone Inn a magnificent location for weddings and events. The hotel features first-class accommodation and dining. Rooms are unique and varied, all decorated with antiques and furnishings from the early 1900s. The inn was uh, furnished in 1902, and this is a very interesting story, with uh, Gustav Stickley uh, arts and crafts furniture. Still remaining in the hotel are over 60 pieces from his first year of operation. Gustav Stickley furniture came from far up in uh, New York to Redstone and furnished this entire town. He himself was on the cutting edge of that area, just as, jo as John Osgood was in his utopian mining community. 
The restaurant attracts diners from Aspen to Vale and is a popular destination on its own with special events scheduled throughout the year. We are not a Victorian hotel. We are definitely totally Americana. It is not from a, a gold and silver as Aspen. It's, it's from coal. The flavor is still there. The character is still there. And uh, I think that makes Redstone unique. Redstone Inn. Unique. Timeless.